Today, let's see how to make cheesecake brownies. Hello dear friends and welcome to Kitchen Compass. For the brownie batter, here I've taken 115 grams of butter and 140 grams of chopped semi-sweet chocolate. Melt this over simmering water or in a microwave. For a detailed recipe on brownies, please check my earlier video. The link is in the description box. You can see that the chocolate and butter has melted. Into this add 160 grams of coarsely powdered sugar and whisk until combined. Add 15 grams of unsweetened cocoa powder and combine well. This recipe requires 3 eggs. Add in the eggs one by one, combining well after each addition. Stir in 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract. Now add the all-purpose flour or maida in batches, combining well after each addition. A total of 90 grams of flour is required for this recipe. Line an 8 by 8 inch square tin with parchment paper. Leave some parchment paper at the sides so we can easily remove the baked brownie cheesecake from the tin. Set aside 2-3 to three tablespoons of the brownie batter. Transfer the remaining batter to the lined baking tray and set it aside. Now let's prepare the cheesecake batter. In the meanwhile, preheat the oven at 170 degrees centigrade. Here I've taken 250 grams of cream cheese. Beat it for a minute and then add 160 grams of finely powdered sugar. Beat this for a few minutes until nice and creamy. Add in 1 egg and 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract and beat it till the ingredients are well blended. Transfer the cheesecake batter on top of the brownie batter. Pour the set aside brownie batter on top of the cheesecake batter and create a design with the toothpick. Bake in a preheated oven at 170 degrees Celsius for 35 to 40 minutes or until the sides are set and center is a bit jiggly. A toothpick inserted should have a few moist crumbs. It will continue to set as it cools down. The cheesecake brownie is ready. This can be stored in airtight containers in the refrigerator for up to one week. Do try this recipe and thanks for watching. 